Right, we're here in Wakefield at the TQ Environmental Showroom, uh, which is uh, just opened up in their head office in Wakefield. So I've got Steve Hancock here. He's going to um, talk to us about uh, some of the uh, the products on demo here on show here in the showroom. Um, so Steve, if you want, just want to uh, lead off and talk to us about uh, the showroom and what you've got here and what uh, why people might want to come up here and have a have a tour. This one is the TQ four two hundred sampling system. Um, this will draw air back from different sampling points throughout any installation. Um, and then sample through the sensor in the panel, um, purge itself through the fresh air line, um, and then move on to the next line. Just below, we've got a couple of examples on how the sampling um, system lines are installed and the different types of filter heads um, that we can have that are in use with this system. This will do a 1 to 8 channel, 1 to 16 channel, and 1 to 24 channel. Okay, and uh, what have we got over here, let's see. This one's a fixed panel TQ4000. Um, this will basically run from one to four sensors. The types of sensors that you can put to these are slightly different to the previous one, which is the sampling panel. Um, these are standalone sensors um, in which the sensor head is underneath the small junction box, um, wired back, giving a signal per channel um, these can be used for hydrogen, oxygen, ammonia, methane, propane, um, the different type of sensor heads. Um, also, running off this one system is an infrared CO2 detector, which is our GD233. Um, these are standalone or can be linked into a system such as the TQ4000. Fantastic. And uh, what about this uh, other one around here, Steve? What's that? TQ8000. A bigger system, pretty much the same principle of, of the TQ4000, but an 8000 panel will run up to 16 sensors, um, again individually set um, and running through a, a larger system, a larger establishment. The number of relays allows it to do a little bit more, so going to beacon sounders, um, shut off systems, pump down systems, etc. And all the panels that we've got so far um, can actually be put into BMS or RDM systems as well, so it can instantly be wired. Great. And, uh, and over here, on, we've got some interesting things on the wall over here. What's going on here? This one, this is the latest addition to TQ. Um, basically, the TQ5000 panel can run 30 sensors per page as per the front display. Um, on the display you can have up to 30 pages giving a maximum of something in the region of 900 sensors that you can just daisy chain. Quite simply, run the main wire from the system into your first sensor and then continue it through just by single wire or dual wire if you want comms and power um, out to approximately 30 sensors per TQ100 unit which is the other unit on the wall here. Um, this is your power unit for the sensors external to the panel if you're running more than 30 sensors um, and this will run um, the comms for those sensors all feeding back to the one panel um, which again will go into alarms, um, beacon sounders or will actually plug into any RDM or BMS system. Brilliant. And uh, Steve, uh, why, uh, why, why do you feel it necessary to start the uh, open up the demo centre? Because well, you only just started this recently, didn't you? I think, yeah, I think as, as opposed to just having the need for, for delivering brochures um, and for people picking up data sheets printed off the website, it's an invitation basically for anybody to come in, see the physical attributes of what the system